Hi viewers, welcome to our YouTube channel. And we are back again with the most important questions of Prelim 2020. Let us begin with the first question. 1. Choose the correctly matched pairs. 1. Vienna Convention, Eliminate AMP, Restrict the Use of Persistent Organic Pollutants. 2. Barcelona Convention, Protect Mediterranean Sea from Pollution. 3. Rotterdam Convention, to promote shared responsibilities in importation of hazardous chemicals. 4. Stockholm Convention, Conservation of Migratory Species of Wild Animals. Select the correct answer using codes given below, A, 1 AMP, 2 only. B, 2 AMP, 3 only. C, 1 AMP, 4 only. D, 3 AMP, 4 only. Answer, B. The reason first statement is incorrect because Vienna Convention is a framework for the protection of the ozone layer. The reason fourth statement is incorrect because Stockholm Convention is to eliminate AMP, restrict the use of persistent organic pollutants. Bonn Convention is for the conservation of migratory species of wild animals. Second question. Consider the following statements, 1. The Hague Conference on Private International Law provides for a method to return a child internationally abducted by a parent from one member country to another. 2. Central Adoption Resource Authority is the nodal body for in-country and inter-country adoptions of Indian children. 3. Government of India has signed DAMP, ratified the Hague Convention. Select the correct answer using codes given below, A, all of the above. B, 1 AMP, 2 only. C, 2 AMP. 3 only. D, 1 amp, 3 only. Answer, B. The reason third statement is incorrect is because India has only ratified it in 2003. The reason India is reluctant to sign the convention is because consider for example an Indian woman, who is married to a NRI in USA and is not a green card holder is escaping marital discord or domestic violence in a foreign country from her NRI husband returns to India with her child. Now here if India is a signatory to the convention it would give an Hague Convention the jurisdiction in India to direct the authorities here to return of the child to the place of habitual residence, the so-called NRI father's country, and would make the mother a child abductor. Oftentimes such litigation is carried only by husbands with a view to compel a woman to give up her claims to alimony and any separation settlement. Third question which of the following statements is slash are correct? 1. Veblen goods AMP, given goods do not follow the fundamentals law of demand AMP, have upward sloping demand curve. 2. A Veblen good is a type of good for which demand increases as the price decreases. 3. Demand for given goods is heavily influenced by a lack of close substitutes and income pressures. Select the correct answer using codes given below, A, 1, 2, 3. B. 1 amp, 2 only. C, 1 amp, 3 only. D, none. Answer, C. Veblen good is a type of luxury good for which demand increases as the price increases. 4. Which of the following statements is or are correct? 1. Bharatiya Poshan Krishi Kash is a repository of diverse crops across agroclimatic zones in India. 2. To ensure intake of proteins to eradicate protein hunger in women and children as part of five-point action plan of MS Swami Nathan. Select the correct answer using codes given below. A. 1 only. B. 2 only. C. Both. D. None. Answer, C. Ministry of Women and Child Development has launched the Bharatiya Poshan Krishi Kash. The country has been broadly divided into 15 agricultural regions based on agroclimatic features, particularly soil type, climate including temperature and rainfall and its variation and water resources for this purpose. During the launch event, the father of the Green Revolution in India, M.S. Swami Nathan put forward the Five Point Action Program for making India nutrition secure and the Five Point Action Program also aligns with different sustainable development goals such as SDG 2, Zero Hunger, SDG 3, Good Health and Well-Being, and SDG 6, Clean Water and Sanitation. Please note. 5. Predimanid is an antibiotic used for the treatment of 1. Malaria 2. 
COVID-19. 3. Tuberculosis. 4. None. Answer, 3. It is used for the treatment of multidrug-resistant tuberculosis affecting the lungs. It is generally used together with bedaquiline and linezolid. 6. Which of the following statements is slash are correct with reference to the provisions of the Mountbatten Plan? 1. The partition of British India into two dominions of India and Pakistan was formulated in this plan. 2. The Boundary Commission was established to decide the international boundaries between the two countries of India and Pakistan. 3. A bicameral federal legislature would be established and provinces will be given complete autonomy. Select the correct answer using codes given below, A, 1 amp, 2 only. B, 2 amp, 3 only. C, 1 amp, 3 only. D, 3 only. Answer, A. The reason third statement is incorrect because Government of India Act 1935 brought in the provision of a bicameral federal legislature and provincial autonomy. Lord Mountbatten was the last viceroy and was assigned the task of a speedy transfer of power by the then British Prime Minister Clement Attlee. He proposed that the provinces be declared independent successor states and then be allowed to choose whether to join the Constituent Assembly or not. This plan was called the Dickie Bird Plan please note. Government of India Act 1935 divided powers between the center and the provinces. 7. Consider the following statements. 1. Morley Minto reforms introduced communal representation in Indian politics. 2. Indians were given membership to the Imperial Legislative Council for the first time under the Indian Councils Act 1909. 3. Lord Minto appointed Satendra P. Singh as the first Indian member of the Viceroy's Executive Council. Select the correct answer using codes given below. A. 1, 2, 3. B. 1 amp, 3 only. C. 2 amp, 3 only. D. 1 amp, 2 only. Answer, A. The Indian Councils Act 1909 was an act of the British Parliament that introduced a few reforms in the legislative councils and increased the involvement of Indians limitedly in the governance of British India. It was more commonly called the Morley Minto reforms after the Secretary of State for India John Morley and the Viceroy of India, Minto. 8. Choose the correctly matched pairs. Atomic power stations and state. Select the correct answer using codes given below. A. 1 amp, 2 only. B. 2 amp, 3 only. C. 1 amp, 4 only. D. 3 amp, 4 only. Answer, A. Nine wealth accounting and the valuation of ecosystem services is an initiative LED by one World Bank, two Asian Development Bank, three International Monetary Fund, four none. Answer one wealth accounting and the valuation of ecosystem services waves is a World Bank led global partnership that aims to promote sustainable development by ensuring that natural resources are mainstreamed in development planning and national economic accounts waves is now part of the broader World Bank umbrella initiative the global program for sustainability 10 which of the following Harappan sites have been recently nominated by India for inclusion in the world heritage list for the year 2020 a dolavira B. Lotal. C. Circatota. D. Mariger. Answer, A. Government of India has submitted two nomination dossiers namely Dolavira, a Harappan city and monuments and forts of Deccan Sultanate for inclusion in the World Heritage List for the year 2020. Government. Of Madhya Pradesh has submitted the proposal of group of monuments at Mandu in the year 2019. That's it for the day. For more information visit our website, and for more such videos like, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel.